I'm gonna try a proxy hatch build. I normally do it with an overlord baked in, but I'm actually gonna try not doing that and seeing if that works. So I'm actually gonna get up to like Sixteen. Yeah. Let's try this. This is new. Okay, this time's out okay. And then we're gonna get our pool next. It's a waste of larva that could be producing in exchange for a sharper timing. So let's see how this plays. Maybe we extract her out two more drones. That sounds okay. Okay. And maybe we do an overlord. Where should we put it? Maybe oversee our net. And then when this thing is about half, we actually get two gases for reals. For realsies. Uh, I think we drone more. We need a queen at home to be able to... deflect any uh, reaper. Do we need a queen on the road? That's my question. I want to say yes. Not enough minerals. We cannot lose this overlord. That's that's really key. So do we get one drone here? Okay, what do I need? Three larva, 75 a piece. Need 225. Do I just save up starting now? I think so. 225.75. So this, I'm gonna need 225, 300 for Ravagers. And I'm one supply short so I can extract or trick out the last one. Okay. Let's do this. So that now we get an overlord. Now let's put some pressure on. Oh, you're dead. And we get more roaches here. No more SCVs! There we go, GG, it's on! <laughs> I actually, I like the timing of this one. It's a little different. Uh, not building the Overlord into the build. I actually like that. Dude, Biles are so strong, they do 60 freaking damage. It's a... Uh, for all you Zerg players, it's a good way to just take a quick, cheap game off of, uh, off of, uh, Terran players. So let's review that builder. We go, uh, we go two drones. We send out the first drone that comes out of an egg. 